This next one might be a, a little divisive. This might be a little divisive. I'm just letting you know talk. It's, it's, it's a serious subject, but something's gone on mind a lot. Uh, there's a lot of talk in recent years about guns in schools, you know, like arming teachers. And uh, that's something I'm very much against. I'm very much against it. Not even because of like my feelings on guns or my political leanings, but because I work as a substitute teacher. <laughs> Y'all don't want me to have a gun. You guys do not want me. You do not want me to have. I get too impatient. You do not want me to have a gun in the school. Okay? That's what's gonna happen. Let's say we arm teachers. Boom! Tomorrow, every teacher in this country has a gun. Yeah. Long before any of them come even close to preventing a school shooting, half the teachers in this country will be immediately fired for threatening children with guns. That will 100 percent. What's the fucking video? It's gonna. Let's do it. And schools already don't give like teachers money for like colored pencils. They're not gonna buy them guns. They're gonna send out a mass email. It's like you gotta bring your own. Just bring, bring your gun to school today. Start Monday. That's what we want. So you'll just have a mishmash of weapons throughout the school. It's like a history teacher with a shotgun propped up by their desk. You know health teacher with a crossbow or something. <laughs> and as a sub, they're not going to have a good gun for me. They're not going to have a good gun. They're going to be like a rusty antique. It'll be like a flintlock pistol that like pirates use. <laughs> i got to sign it out on a clipboard. You know? <laughs> it's got a school lanyard on it. And they're gonna be like, those are a pain to reload. Make that shot count, buddy. Have a good day. <laughs> Got their molds and mines. <laughs> when people find out I'm a sub, too, they, they'll come up to me and they'll be like, I bet that gives you a lot of material for your stand up. I bet it gives you a lot of material. And you'd think, but not really. <laughs> but not really. Because like, kids have two modes to me they're boring and annoying. Like, that's what children are. Like, I can tell the people who ask me that, like, have kids because they have, like, magic in their eyes about children, but to, I'm still a civilian, you know? Like, I don't... A kid is just a short guy, I can't tell the fuck off yet. Like, it's really all that kid is to me, so I don't... I don't have to ooh about it, you know? So... The closest thing I have to a story from subbing is one time I was in the room I was subbing in, and this young girl walks in, and she was just eating a packet of sour cream. Just, just sour cream, by itself, nothing with it, just raw dog and daisy, just... She walks in, I just go, is that sour cream? And she goes, yeah. And that's the end of the story, nothing happened after that. I just... Because I chose to not further interact with this child. I backed away slowly and <laughs> gave her the space she deserves.